You bought me a new beer pong table. This is perfect beer pong. <laughs> So what we've now done in here is um, giving the dogs a place to dry off after they uh, come in from a walk. And as you can see, a little flickster in the corner there. Just enjoying a nice lay down while I'm having a tour around the gym. And what we're thinking about doing, I was just speaking to Dad just now, is uh, as, a, as the next upgrade for the gym is bringing this forward. As you can see, there's a little indent here. You can see there's a, it goes back a little bit. And so what we would do would be to bring that forwards and so it's level with this block here. That would then mean that we could have a bigger mirror rather than this little thin bit. It would mean we could have a nice long mirror just to check your form properly and have a look at those gains you're making. Another upgrade would be to upgrade these. They only go up to 22.5 kilos as you can see there at the minute, but they do have the potential to go up to 41 kilos. And so obviously, not many people, and not me anyway, not for a very long time, will go above 41 kilos for dumbbells. And so that would do for at least another year, another couple of years, at least. And the final thing would be to paint this door. I'm a little bit undecided as to what to do with it, to be honest. Whether to put this logo on there, whether to put the LSJ Fitness T logo on there, colour to paint it, uh, whether to keep it a nice grey colour scheme like everything else. Uh, let me know in the comment section, guys. Let me know what you think, what upgrades we should do. Um, and I'll get back to you. I have absolutely no idea why at the start of the video I didn't mention this, but I've actually come back to Melton as well to change my phone. The back camera doesn't work, and so it needs changing. We've got to go to Leicester, which is closer to Melton than it is to Nottingham. So um, coming home was just the easier option. I mean, seriously though, can you believe it? A £1,000 phone. £1,000, and the back camera doesn't work. Stupid. Okay guys, so we're back in Nottingham now, we're back from Melton and I have this here, Alpha Lee packet, in a nice sort of branded uh, packaging there to open. I've got two things here, two Evo t-shirts in the discount uh, sale that they did. I got these for like $16 each, which is like £12, £13 for two of these t-shirts. And So I'm just, I'm not going to do a full unboxing review video or anything like that. I'm just going to show you uh, me taking it out of the pack, trying it on, giving you guys my first impressions. So um, obviously I, ha I don't actually have one of these t-shirts uh, before, I have the Zenith line which was the previous to the Evo, but two, the two that I managed to buy uh, that were still actually in stock, were this baby blue colour which is really nice and uh, a sort of like a maroony type colour there which looks kind of, of, uh, looks kind of browny blackish on camera but um, it's a really really nice colour, I really like this. So um, first things first, we we'll just try on the blue one. Okay, so it feels feels really light, a lot lighter than the Zenith line. The Zenith uh, was light, but kind of felt a little bit thicker. And the thing I didn't really like about it was that it holds your gut a lot, and sort of, you know, as you guys know, peak bulk at the minute. Um, Hugging something, hugging your uh, your gut is not that great. So wow, okay, yeah, this uh, really wow, this really rounds uh, round your shoulders. Nice thin material, nice breathable sleeves, not too long. Yeah, I like it. And here is the exact same shirt in the purple, guys. As you can see, it rounds the shoulders again really nicely. Kind of fits in all the right places, doesn't hug the gut too much, it does a little bit. I feel like it does more on this one rather than the baby blue one. Uh, but maybe that's just me, but maybe that's just the colour, I don't know. But um, yeah, very happy with these purchases. So what I just wanted to take a minute to talk to you guys about is that tomorrow, starting March 5th, as this video will come out, I will be starting my cut. The macros will be as follows, I'll put them on the screen as well. But it will be 2,210 calories, 250 carbs, 190 protein and 50 fats. And what I'm going to do is just see how my body reacts to that. At the minute I weighed in this morning at just over 188 pounds. And so the goal is over the next 90 days to lose 13 pounds to get down to 175. And so that just means that because last time I cut down, sort of, sort of cut down, just wanted to lose a little bit of weight. Last time I did that, I got down to 175 and looked decent. And so obviously with a few more pounds of muscle on my frame, I might look even better. And so it was really, really interesting for me to find out, for me to cut down and accept this challenge 
uh, and see what I'm going to look like. Obviously in this time as well I am still a student so I'm going to still be going out, still making the most of and enjoying the student life. As well as that I'm also going out tonight because actually it's a celebration for finishing placement. And as you can see, it was an emotional goodbye. And one of the reasons I'm so excited about this challenge, this little 90 day cut that I'm gonna be doing, it's about three months and it's gonna be a different kind of challenge for me because I've never actually been on a cut whilst at university. I've only really trained for the last year to 18 months. And so obviously I've only sort of bulked and cut once. So seeing how I can balance the alcohol, balance the fitness, balance the work, balance YouTube, balance everything, and still manage to cut down and be consistent in every way possible, is going to be a massive, massive challenge for me. And to be honest guys, I'm really excited for it. Now before you guys go crazy in the comment section, there is a reason for this cut. People are gonna be saying, Liam, why are you cutting? You're not even that big. Liam, why are you cutting? You're young, you can bulk and put on loads of mass. Liam, why are you cutting? You've not even been bulking for that long. Yes, all of the above are true, but there is a reason. What I'm gonna be doing is entering a competition, guys. This isn't a step on stage competition, get, get lean, get really shredded kind of competition. This is just uh, make a better version of yourself, improve yourself in every way possible. The competition I'm entering is Christian Guzman's Summer Shredding Series. Now, a lot of you will already know what Christian's competition is, a lot of you won't. So for those who don't, this is what it is. He's going on a 90 day cut himself, Christian Guzman, and then from that, he's doing this Summer Shredding Series and a competition within that. He's gonna pick 10 people, 10 winners, who have made the best progress, made the most difference to the physique, most and bettered themselves the most. And yes guys, there is a prize, but to be honest with you guys, that's not the big deal here. The big deal would be getting recognition from someone that I've looked up to for literally four or five years now. So that is you guys caught up on my macros, diet, and if you want me to explain my training, how I'm gonna be training, what kind of cardio I'm gonna be doing, pop them in the comment section down below. Leave a like if you did enjoy the video guys, because that is going to conclude today's vlog. I know it's uh, no, there's no training in it, but to be honest, I thought this would be something a little bit different, going home, exchanging my phone and all that kind of stuff. Um, that sounds really boring now I say it like that. But uh, anyway, that is going to round off today's video, guys. So thanks a lot, as always, for watching. If you did enjoy it, let me know by leaving a like. Comment any questions you have about macros, training, anything like that, and I'll be happy to get back to you as soon as I see the comment, guys. So thanks a lot for watching, as always, guys. And remember, no regrets, and I'll see you guys in the next video.